Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft is going to be deprecating another Windows 11 feature. And this time it's not an old legacy feature. It's actually quite a new feature that was added to the Windows OS just a couple of years ago, where Microsoft now has officially announced that it's adding Windows 11's suggested actions to the list of deprecated features. And this is over on their deprecated features documentation website. Now, just a quick recap, uh, the suggested actions menu, um, in case you're unaware, is a feature that automatically appears whenever you copy a phone number, as we can see here at the top, or a date here at the bottom, and provides contextual actions based on what has been copied. So if you copy a phone number, the menu will display apps that can make phone calls, such as Teams, and edge and if you copy a date it will display apps that can create reminders or events as in outlook and calendar so that's just the gist of what these suggested actions are all about now microsoft has this to say officially and i'm quoting suggested actions that appear when you copy a phone number or future date in windows 11 are deprecated and will be removed in a future windows 11 update now they don't give us an exact date and time when it will be removed but deprecated basically means that it's no longer supported or in development so you may see it still in your os but in a future update which we don't know when that's going to happen they will be removing this from the operating system and i must be honest i don't even think this feature made its way to my region i've never used it i've never seen a need to be able to use suggested actions so i w won't really miss it to be quite honest with you so i'm not really sorry to see that one go but uh, nonetheless, um, the reason why Microsoft could be removing suggested actions is because, as in my case, um, not enough users were actually using the feature. And also, they are now focusing on click to do which is an AI-powered feature that's part of Windows Recall, which basically, at the end of the day, using AI will do um, more or less the same thing. So maybe they don't want to have to be developing two different tools doing the same thing. Um, but nonetheless, there we go suggested actions is no more and is unsupported and will be removed in a future update to the os so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one